Hello, this is uh, the team from Infinity Ward. Uh, yes, and uh, we are showing you some leaked footage of Modern Warfare 4. Uh, yes, this is uh, the campaign of Modern Warfare 4. Uh, we've been spending, we've been working about a week and a half on this. Yes, uh, we think it's pretty good. It's uh, We think it's pretty fit for release soon. That's the radar. That's the new radar. We thought that uh, green and blue would be perfect for this. Yeah, because a lot of people like those colors, and uh, we decided it was a lot simpler just to make it green and blue. Uh, so yeah, the campaigns are, uh, we increased the graphics majorly, so as you can yeah, see. As you can see, uh, the grass textures and everything else are amazingly better than any other Call of Duty game, especially ones made by Treyarch, you little bitches. We made a new campaign generator, so now that uh, the maps will vary based on uh, Minecraft, Yes. Uh, as you can see now, watch, we're gonna show you the explosion animation. That's the helicopter going down. And these are combat animations we're gonna show you. All this good stuff. Uh, we decided to add in game tutorials. Yes, this was uh, good for us. Decided. Uh, we thought that, uh, that we should add missions where a pilot crashes, you have to save him. Yes. And if uh, you don't, you uh, lose, you have to restart see. the entire campaign. We added uh, tutorials during the campaign definitely uh, make it a lot more so you know what you're doing yes uh, now we had now we had real marine seal beret killer special black ops guys come in reload the super LMG death machine guns uh, yes um, we also added a uh, we also had a lot more voice actors come in and do it uh, in a second here you'll hear uh, Dwayne the Rock Johnson uh, when when he gets up to the pilot you're going to hear our prestigious voice actor Dwayne the Rock Johnson now here's a reloading animation Oh, that was perfect. Definitely would have done. Yeah, thanks, now we have more okay. facial expressions, too. I'll uh, radio in a helicopter. I'll be fine. You finish your mission. See, that was a, a nodding animation that we invented. Only we have it. Uh, another thing is, to um, we took out special grenades and perks. We thought it was totally, uh, stupid and useless, because no one ever uses special grenades or perks. Uh, all we have are frag grenades. We added three different sensitivities, Instead low, medium, and high. 0 and 10 was because it was such an overkill to people didn't know which one to use. Yeah, people uh, were too confused by numbers. Another thing, uh, we added 30 to 40 different guns. Uh, actually, we uh, decided that was too many, so now we only have 5. Uh, we have an assault rifle, an assault rifle with scope, we an LMG, add, and an RPG. We were going to add such uh, amazing things to like flamethrowers, but my buddy Kalag uh, Houston over here uh, decided not to. Yeah, and uh, Justin decided it would be good to take out sniper rifles, because no one ever uses sniper rifles. Yeah, so it's very stupid. Yeah, no one. No one ever uses. Uh, on the thoughts of a uh, campaign, we decided to take it out. Yeah, we made the AI a lot smarter, too. It was a lot better. We, uh, we decided... Now you see the dying animation here. Oh, uh, definitely. Uh, it took uh, 28 guys to make that. Yeah, and by 28, we mean me and him. Uh, definitely. Uh, Houston added the uh, effect of the uh, camera turning to get it a built-in effect that you're actually the character. Yeah, uh, we decided to make it more realistic. And I see the objective. I made it so you don't have to redo objectives if you die. They're already done no matter what. Uh, we also had an add-on where you no. can plug in a USB. It's, now here's the uh, the AI using uh, Microsoft AI bots. And you see it's very smart and very aware of its surroundings. And uh, it's always going to be aware of where the player is no matter where it goes or if it's being sneaky. Right. So you see it's very smart. It's extreme, It's being extremely smart right now. We should probably tell some of the uh, indie game developers uh, how they uh, work uh, the program we were using. Yeah, uh, Microsoft AI bots made exclusively for Windows, so if you're using a Mac, go fuck yourself. See the grenade explosion in the background? We uh, decided we, to make it so you can throw grenades about 80 feet. We added a, a USB port, uh, DLC, where uh, when you plug it into your system, it points a gun at you, and if you die in the game, you die in real life. It's uh, supposed to be a new uh, visual effect. Also, there are no DLCs. Uh, yes, uh, if you pay uh, $80 million for a premium, you will get... Uh, no DLCs. Uh, you will get five DLCs, but no DLCs. Yes. You will get no bullets, maybe no guns, maybe you'll get a bullet casing. Uh, we also added a new difficulty, Veteran X2. You unlock it by beating Veteran and Veteran X1. Uh, uh, you start off with a knife. A paring knife. And you go around uh, killing enemies that have... Riot shields, they're all juggernauts, they have over shields like in Halo. They're all super strong, and uh, it takes about... It takes 25 ki hits to get the riot shield off, 37 to get the RPGs off. By the way, there are RPG rockets on their faces. Uh, 28 to get the claymores off of them, 14 to dis disarm, and 20,000 to kill. Now here's the grenade animation. That was perfect. Water textures, that was very beautiful. Uh, another thing is that um, if you pick up the gun in the X2, you also get a cardboard gun. Yeah, they, they just become cardboard. The yeah. thing is uh, guns. Uh, people were also questioned about the multiplayer. There is none. There is none. We decided to make hip firing more accurate. Just to, We decided to make hip firing as accurate as if you fired from the sights.
Oh yes, uh, our fellow uh, comrades, also known as Dick Buckets, uh, uh, hey, Treyarch, Mike, come over Mike, and uh, say uh, we need something like zombies, and we said fuck you, suck a gay butt. So we decided to take out um, zombies at any type of survival mode. There's only campaign. There's only campaign, and there's no co-op. We thought they were gonna add 12 player co-ops, but Houston over here uh, decided not to because co-op. Yeah, we wanted 57 player co-op. But we took it out because it was a bit of an overkill. Yeah, there was too many players we thought that we didn't need 57. So we decided to add only one player. You can only play with one person ever in the entire game. There's no spec ops, no multiplayer, no nothing. And the part of the release, this game comes out uh, in five years, but we decided to bump it to 30 seconds. And uh, another thing, uh, that's for Xbox players. Uh, they get in 30 seconds. Uh, PlayStation players, we're still sticking to the 12 year uh, wait. Yeah, because we wanted to make it uh, a little... Just a little teeny bit better, maybe at a bullet casing. Yes, uh, uh, another thing is, uh, remember, it's, uh, you have to get uh, $120 if you want the veteran package. It comes with a uh, plastic McDonald's toy. That That's... we found in a tree. It was all beat up underneath a uh, dead ferret. And yeah, you get that if you buy the veteran pack. Oh, uh, we also added a ranking system to multi uh, campaign. I'm sorry, you... there is no multiplayer. If you get one kill, you get all ranks and 10 prestigious. Another thing is that there's 250 ranks each a rank, and uh, we'll give you an example rank of uh, 148, the Super Garden Sergeant Sergeant Commander 3, that is uh, one of the things, and you unlock a uh, camo. Uh, which, there really is no use of camo, camo is your socks. So yeah, we took it out. Yeah, so we took the camo that you unlock out, and there's also one achievement, it's with the grenade launcher, but there's no grenade launchers, so you're gonna have to work really hard to get that. So yeah, uh, there's uh, so enjoy the wide variety of three campaign missions, the multiplayer we just took out, uh, uh, and the and the uh, spec ops doesn't exist now. Uh, come we did out. we did put on the option of spec ops. We put it right there just just so it can look it can look cool. Doesn't do anything. Yeah, so, uh, so you know you go out buy the game, support us, put money in our wallets, buy premium for seventy eight million thousand dollars, and uh, have a nice day. Faggots.